A new drama surrounding American Idol, the hit show now under fire from a group of former contestants who say they were kicked off because of their race. ABC's Cecilia Vega has our story. You did not make the top 24. It is the hit show where singers can get you. the boot we'll for you, missing a luck. note. You, but can contestants also get the boot from American Idol simply based on their race? Nine former contestants have filed a legal complaint against the show, reportedly claiming they were kicked off for that very reason. According to TMZ, the group says the show tried to humiliate African-American contestants, many with arrest records, by exposing their pasts for ratings. This morning, their lawyer tells ABC News it is an issue for the courts. Idol producers and the show's network, Fox, aren't commenting. Of all the people who literally were taken off of the program, um, they have been all African American. Is that a coincidence? It's kind of hard to tell. Contestants including finalist Corey Clark, disqualified from season two after a battery arrest and semi-finalist Jared Andrews sent packing over an assault charge. And I don't need... Producers also booted the Brittenham twins after identity theft charges surfaced. Be a freak. And season nine's Chris Golightly was disqualified after questions over whether he was still tied to a boy band. I really cannot recall any time on the show where I felt discriminated against. Season six finalist Melinda Doolittle says the one thing American Idol isn't is racist. Three of the show's past winners are black. Other past contestants say singers on Idol are required to disclose arrests. Season 4's Von Zell Solomon tells ABC News in a statement, I was clearly informed of all grounds for disqualification stated in our contracts. Idol has changed my life for the better. I didn't feel like there was any special attention given to someone because of race, so I, I really can't see where this is coming from. But where it may be headed? To a courtroom. The group reportedly plans to sue. For Good Morning America, Cecilia Vega, ABC News, Los Angeles.